All right, so first up, we have a furniture flip here. They have an old chair and they are adding some fabric. Great DIY project to try if you're bored. If you want to revamp your furniture, here's a good way to do it. Wow, I love this idea. Hello everyone, welcome back to Design Trend Seeker. If you are new around here, my name is Danielle, and on this channel, we like to take a look at trending DIY project ideas and react to them. Cool tear tray there. And then we have someone at the store getting some pool noodles. What? No, they made a sofa out of pool noodles. That is no. Are you kidding me right now? This is insane. This is sorcery, I cannot believe. Wow, absolutely amazing. And we have someone adding some design to their ceiling with these full ceiling beams. Oh, they made a little planner with that. I think maybe they should have painted it. it looked kind of basic. And then we have someone doing some type of canvas artwork here. So we already saw the finished product of this. And I must say I'm pretty impressed. You guys know I love black and gold. So of course I'm going to be a fan of this project. But we're seeing a lot of that, like textured canvas art. And the way that the person put this together just looks absolutely amazing. I would have never thought like, oh, okay, you can spray paint the top and do like this really pretty gold. Like, look at that. That looks insane. And then they just painted the bottom black. Not only does this look like high-end and fashionable, but it looks like a pretty easy project. So this person looks like they might be doing some type of table. Oh, they made a tear tray. Okay, I was not expecting that. I was thinking they were making a table. Decorative vase. My clients were uncomfortable. I ain't buying a new chair. I heard that. So I guess she bought like some cushions to put on it. And some fabric. Mm, I needed a better look at that to see if it would have actually been like, I mean, it's a good idea. They were pretty basic chairs that she had. Whoa. Oh my gosh, she really upgraded that fireplace. All right, so we got someone making some tables here. Oh, wait a minute, that's it? Okay, I thought she was gonna do like something else with them. Like she just left them plain wood. That's not fun. Okay, maybe this is the continuation because I'm so confused right now. Like that was some boring tables if you just leave it like that. Okay, wow. Oh, wow, those look so good. Oh my gosh, I'm so impressed. Okay, someone's taken an old coffee table in a mirror. So she's inspired by this stone mirror trend. Everybody loves that. But she's doing a big mirror here. This is a pretty epic project to take on. I'm sure like a, a large stone mirror of this magnitude would be really expensive too. So wow, this is pretty impressive. A 
gem ball and a large planter oil, layered fabric, cement, fiberglass tape, plate ball, remove. Is she making a table out of this? What is that supposed to be though? I don't get it. I mean, it was really pretty, but I just want to know what it was. Okay, this looks like candle holders, maybe? It's just doing the splattering effect. Oh yeah, definitely candle holders. Oh, these are cute. I like the fact that they don't look perfect, like they're like weird shapes. Office chair upcycle. All right, let's see what they're gonna do with this chair. So far, so good. Oh, putting rope on there. Looks like she's turning it into a bench. Oh, well, maybe not. There's the top part. Okay, I know she's not just gonna leave that because that is not a functional chair. That's just like a decorative chair. You can't sit on that. Let's see what they do with this one. Lots and lots of foam. What? It's a foam chair. Okay, we gotta find some better ideas. This is crazy. Now, is this a functional chair that we can sit on? That's my question. Oh, she painted it pink. That's interesting. Eh, I'm not a fan of that. I'm sorry. It's too weird looking. DIY side table. What is she using for the base? Is that styrofoam? Oh, wow. That came out really nice. Okay, we have a letter A here. Oh, they put rhinestones on it. Yeah, it's cute. Cute, cute. Kind of looks like a kid made it, though. Okay, we got an old checker chair. Oh, they're spray painting it. This kind of plays right into like that uh, pastel trend that's going around. I'm not mad at it. It looks pretty cute. I'd, I'd uh, sit in that. I don't know if I'd have it in my living room, but you know. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. Please be sure to give it a big thumbs up. And if you wanna see more DIY project ideas and reactions, you can check out this video next.